Hi everyone, my name's Helen and I'm a CFO here at Home Group. Today's video we're going to cover some of the financial challenges that Home Group and our customers are experiencing, uh, including talking a little bit about why rent and service charges are, are going up this year. So here at Home Group, as you can imagine, we spend a lot of money on um, supplies for both our maintaining our existing homes, um, so that's doing repairs, things that customers log, but also building new homes. Um, and we're seeing the cost of those materials go up significantly. Um, as a bit of an example, glass currently is at a 40 year high. And as you can imagine, as a house builder um, and a housing provider, we use a lot of glass. So we're just seeing a huge increase in the cost of, of those raw materials. Um, you also might have noticed as a customer that some of your repairs are taking a bit longer. Uh, that's due to availability. So we are seeing a shortage for some materials and, and, and then actually that is therefore taking us a bit longer to get around to those jobs. So at Home Group, we provide uh, support and care services, and, and that's the area of the business where we're seeing a huge shortage in uh, staff. Um, now, there's a number of external factors um, leading to that, but ultimately what it means for us is we are struggling to recruit, so we're seeing vacancies in our services and in our care provision. The other impact it has is that it just makes that um, more expensive. So either you know the, the market is more competitive, so we have to pay people more to come into the business, to deliver those services, or we're just not able to recruit permanently and we end up using agency staff and agency staff are a lot more expensive. So Home Group, just like every other organisation and also uh, every other person in the country are experiencing huge increases in the cost of energy. So we use a lot of energy across our estate, whether that be in our offices or our services or delivering energy direct into our customers' homes. Um, and at the moment, you know, in comparison to 12 months ago, we've seen 200 to 300% increase in our gas and electricity costs. And we're doing the very best we can with our suppliers to negotiate um, and to deliver value for money in that area. But just like everybody else, it's a really big challenge for us. The way we calculate service charges is a question I get asked a lot. Um, and it's actually a really, really simple thing. So on an annual basis, we look at the services that we're going to provide um, and we look at what the cost of those services are and we charge that back to customers. So we absolutely do not make any profit from uh, service charges. It is simply what it costs for the gardening to be done or the cleaning to be done. And then we pass that on to customers and that's what they pay for. So I think this is probably the question that you all want to know the answer to. So why have we chosen to put up rent by 7% during a time when you know, the cost of living crisis and customers we know are, are struggling to pay other bills? Um, the exec and the board deliberated about this for a long time. Um, you know, should we have a rent increase at all? If we do, what level should it be? But ultimately, we came to the decision to, to put up the rent by 7%. And, and really, that's just as a result of all the things I've talked about in this video. Um, we are seeing the price of our people go up, the price of materials, um, supplies, energy. So with the accumulation of all of that, um, the cost of delivering the customer promise, which is what we're here to do, has gone up. So hopefully the video has given you a little bit more insight into the financial challenges of Home Group and also why we put up the rent this year um, and also how we calculate service charges. I think the final bit for me would just be that, you know, there is support available if customers need it. So please do speak to your housing manager or your support worker. If you are struggling to pay either your rent or your service charge, they're there to talk to you about what support is available. So please do speak to them. Thank you very much for listening.